What is up everybody, I am Legend. In today's video, I'm going to be talking all about what I think is the best tool for singers, songwriters, and musicians to track down all their ideas in this little iPhone app called Tully. Coming right up, let's go. So Tully, I mentioned this in a video before about my five best apps that I think every musician needs to have on their phone. So this is an app for musicians, songwriters, beat makers to kind of just get their ideas out in a very effective way. No longer do you have to have your music app open, notes app open, and then your voice memos open, three different applications. No, you have that all in one single application. So when you first open the app, it's gonna ask you to make an account and all that stuff. Um, so you have this uh, first menu here after you create your account, you have all of your files, your projects, and your masters, which is gonna be something that your engineer sends over once you complete like a project. Then we go to the next tab over. This is going to be the beats and the music or whatever it is that you wanna import, audio files that you can basically play and get ideas. If I hit this free beat here. Hey, hey, hey. So it'll basically play like some songs for you, um, whatever songs that you import, import these into a project and start writing your music, start writing ideas and recording ideas. But also the cool thing about this is if you don't already have the BPM or the key of the song detected, it'll do that for you. So I'll select this little loop that I imported yesterday because it was a really dope beat that I heard online and I started writing something to it. So. Now, you'll see the BPM and the key at the top. There's nothing there. If you want to detect it, I think what I can do is uh, go here and click detect. And we'll see. So it's 85 BPM in G minor. <laughs> so it's pretty cool. It's a pretty cool feature, I think. Um, for this application. So this is also a great tool for those people who are using GarageBand. If you don't want to upload your stuff into audiokeychain.com, which is already simple enough. If you have something on your phone like this, you want to find out the key on the go, this is a great uh, application to use for that. So that is how you detect the BPM and the key of the song. Now, uh, going back to the, this main uh, menu on the play screen here, um, you can click the, the middle right here to start writing a song to this beat. Now, if I want to put it on a loop for a particular part of the song or the whole thing, I can do that, but we're just going to go like this. So basically, I just selected the loop. It's going to loop that part over and over, um, and then I can just go ahead and write to this song. Click the middle. Gonna ask me to name my project, and I'll just call it Tester One. Create. Now we're in our notes section. We're in our lyrics section, so we can continue writing the song without exiting the app and having to go into the music app or swipe up and swipe down to click the play button. Uh, we don't have to go to voice memos to record. All of it is in one app, which is what I love about this application. So. Like, I, you know, you can just go ahead and write whatever you want to write. Now, these are bars, clearly. But, um, so you can, you know, start there. Sometimes you're having writer's block. You can't think of a rhyming word to go with a phrase that you just came up with, a word that you just came up with. And you don't want to go to rhymezone.com or have to exit the thing to go to another app to get, no. What you, all you have to do is double click and highlight one of the words and you'll notice there's a section all the way to the right that says rhyme. You just click rhyme and it'll come up with all kinds of words that rhymes with that word that you have highlighted. So we got bar, car, star, avatar, far, r, spar, jar, bazaar, repertoire. Check my repertoire. How do you spell that word? I mean, whatever. It's, it's really dope, man. We can take it a step further and we can record to this beat without having to go to voice memos. So we're gonna click the record button. I think that's what this is here. Okay, we're gonna play the music here. All without leaving the app. Hit the record button. Yeah. You're the superstar. I wanna go far. My name is Shafar. Check my repertoire. Yeah. I don't know. Boom. So we'll pause it 
and then we'll go to the uh, the recordings here. So you have basically all your recordings. You have the track itself. Can you follow? Take the check mark and press play. Yeah, yeah, the superstar. I wanna go far. My name is the star. Take my whip and swap. Yeah. Now, if I had headphones on, this would be a lot more clear because you wouldn't hear the beat in the background. But also, this is that's a pretty good feature to have if you want to hear how your your voice sounds to the music without having to line it up in this app because you can line it up. I think it's better for just taking down the notes of like how you want the melody to go, how you want the harmonies to go. Um, but don't worry about like trying to stack it and line it up all in the same thing because it's going to be way too much work. I think that's something that they need to work on in this app. But to simply get out the ideas, to do all that without leaving the app, getting rhyming words, melodies, harmonies, notes, choruses, the music, the lyrics, all this stuff in one app. Normally it would take five applications to do that. That's a, that's amazing. That's unheard of. So um, really dope. So I already showed you how to write the lyrics, how to get the rhyming words, how to record your vocals and things, but I need to actually show you guys how to import music into this application. If you have a Mac, if you have an iPhone, you can airdrop it straight into the application and it'll pop up right there, as you guys can see. Or you can um, have the music sent to your email and then within your email, you open it up on your, your phone, you click to save it into basically this application. So that's Tully, man. It's a really dope app, a really great app for creators. I hope this video helps all of you musicians and songwriters out there. Thank you guys for watching. As always, uh, scroll down, hit that like button. If it did, subscribe if you're not already subscribed, turn on the bell notifications. You'll be notified every time I upload a brand new video. As always, stay legendary and I'll see you in I don't want to say that um stay legendary <laughs>